Good morning. Uh, we are going, obviously, doing the water run. So, introduce you to the team. We got a modest 4C with Swift Swim. Passive is Drizzle. So yeah, we're, we were tired of running into the Archie Maxi guy, whoever brought his own weather. So we decided, you know what, we're bringing one of our own. And we are rocking modest because in Swift Swim, we should be able to outspeed everything. Uh, egg moves, Snipe Shot, Hurricane, Dragon Energy, and Frost Breath. Might ideally try to get rid of Frost Breath just for like Ice Beam, but it is really good because it does crit all the time, so any stat changes will not affect it. Then, we had to bring Mud Kick. Um, all the egg moves, Icicle Crash, Searching Strikes, Bulk Up, and Shore Up for a little extra recovery. Might switch one of these moves out, probably for like an Earthquake. Uh, we are running Jolly, so... Uh, we can obviously hopefully outspeed everything and this is also a mega and mega swampert does get swift swim so once again in the rain and drizzle uh, it will be a lot faster than everything else and jolly's kind of just to ensure that so we have torrent obviously the same ability that everybody has and this passive is also drizzle we do not have one rain setter we have two okay um and then we have clauncher because i've caught in like two of these mr crabs um, looking guys, so I had to say, I had to bring him to the team. Ability is Mega Launcher, it doesn't change even when it evolves, and its passive is also Swift Swim. So, something that is normally really slow but kind of bulky is also gonna get that extra speed boost, which is why we are going Timid instead of Jolly or anything like that. It is a special attacker, blocking the egg moves in Armor Cannon, uh, Water Shuriken, and Shell Smash. I'm pretty sure Water Gun's just a regular move, but these should be really good, Water Shuriken, especially for um, priority. Uh, and then we're rocking the Choodle, uh, because Choodle also gets a Dynamax form, so, or I guess it's Evolution does. We're rocking the Egg Muse and Fire Fang, Excel Rock, Vicious Rent, and Shell Smash. Uh, Jolly for the extra speed, because this thing actually doesn't get Swift Swim. Uh, it's passive is instead of Rock Head, so if you get a really strong Rock move, probably like Head Smash, probably throw that on this thing, but Vicious Rent should be absolutely atrocious. Uh, very good move. And then... We brought Sobble because I was like, you know what, let's just bring another starter. We are going Timid on this guy for speed, Rock and Arrow Blast, Frost Breath, and Searing Shot. Really good coverage. Um, Sniper didn't get its pass because I just didn't have enough candies. Uh, and then we just caught a low tad because we had not used it. Um, as you can see, once again in this corner, we're using Mons. We have not completed a classic run before, and everybody passes the test. So, let's get the Reviver Seed. And I think I just want to throw it on Mud Kit because I really want to get that Mega down the line. Ivy, this is the one day you should not bring a grass type. And you brought poor, poor, poor Trickerita. Um, yeah. Not gonna go over well. In the rain, Hurricane is a 100% accurate move, so we don't even have to worry about it missing. And I think we're probably gonna steamroll this run. Water is a very strong type offensively and defensively, and a lot of these guys get secondary types uh, later on. Rare Candy? Give it a month, kid. Alrighty, see you at Fight 95. Uh, I forgot that I, like, got a whole batch of eggs before my, at the end of my last Maridon run, and we now have a red shiny Skiddo, which is actually pretty cool. Can't do the grass run anymore, but uh, I might evolve this thing, or throw up a picture of what it looks like fully evolved. I present to you the purple swamp, or look at him go. Damn, he actually looks really red on the record. I don't know. I, my color settings all messed up. They don't even matter. I actually want to use this guy when he mega evolves. Give me the mega bracelet, the Dynamax band, and let me get all my forms, please, for the sake of the thumbnail. We have Larry the Lobster getting his anchor arms. Look at him. Yes, sir. He got his anchor arms, and now all the ladies love him. He's such a jerk. Now I'm a jerk, and everybody loves me. So order now, wimp. We have the king of the sea, shiny, Kingdra, yes sir, swim, swim, drizzle, um, it did change to poison point during seizure, but I think the ability should be back to swift swim, sometimes it changes when they evolve, um, no, you're not gonna be a dancing dragon, I'm sorry, okay, got our fight with Ivy here, um, I feel like we don't really need an EXP all, to be completely honest, uh, maybe just cap them out. Uh, leading off the Kingdra normally forces the Ganyan switch. And I think regardless, I go for Hurricane here. Yeah, in case you decide to do something crazy and just stay in. We do have a couple X items, which is pretty nice. We should be out speed. 
Dragon Energy at 150 base power is absolutely gonna murder Dragapult. And for you, probably a snipe shot. Yeah, okay. Really nice. Uh, the plan that I wish to unfold is unfolding. Uh, I think snipe shot does more than Dragon Energy here. This is in the rain. Yep, okay, cool. I wonder if Dragon Energy uh, would have paid it or not. And then for Sigilyph, once again, taking my Shiny. I'm glad she at least took the Shiny one out. Uh, using my own Pokemon against me, and that's that's her, weak that's her weakness, because I know their weaknesses. I'm playing chess, she's playing checkers. Uh, I think that when you're doing certain challenge runs, you that's a very unfortunate miss. Uh, you definitely get guys, like, they definitely put you against, I feel like, certain gym leaders and stuff, because this is like the second or third time I've gotten a Muck, and Muck's passive is Water Absorb, so that, obviously, on the Water Endless Run, kind of, you have to just work around it. I have fought Iono twice, I fought Alessa once, who are obviously Electric-type gym leaders, and I think they're just trying to set you up to fail, but enjoy this Legendary egg. Anything good? Wow, the Water Guy on the Water Run. Okay, kind of cool. Two extra candies. Very nice. Okay, we are fighting Team Plasma. Um, we have the Getsus fight, and we have a bunch of X items. So we're hoping that even though Getsus is saying, I won't allow anyone to stop me, no matter who does what, that's a mm, that's a very odd last sentence. I feel like he didn't say that before. Probably a fine time to bulk up. How many surging? We only have four surging strikes. I really need to get this guy some, like, a wide lens or something. I probably should have brought more shinies because our luck has not been, uh, really, really good. But, uh, I really need some wide lenses. Hopefully a Dynamax band. Normally we at least have, like, a Dynamax band or something by now. Um, do I even wanna... I think I want a surging strikes for the potential KO. Speed Rose, that's a little unfortunate. Wow, he actually hits two Dragon Rushes. Good for him. Kind of a... I wouldn't say not a scary team, but let's see... Is this thing Water Absorb? We actually hit an Icicle Crash. Who would have guessed it? I think it's missed two times in a row, a bunch of times. I don't know why. I don't understand why. 90% chance. Yeah, now you have mummy or whatever, dude. You have mummy. And a reviver seed. Oh, the ability? Wow, so you lose mummy if you get your reviver seed. That's uh, interesting. And this is what we were waiting for certain strikes. Okay, Wolf Run is pretty scary. But this guy always switches up his team massively uh, in between this fight and the 165 fight. Did I flinch? What happened? Did I miss? Probably missed, because that move is just way too inaccurate. How can this be? The creator of Team Plasma, I'm perfect. I don't know, man. Your your win-loss against me is like 0-10, big dog. I don't I don't think you're really perfect. Oh, thanks, the PP Max. Not what I needed. Okay, we have uh, the Ivy fight. We are not uh, leading off who we ideally want to lead off with. And our only X item is uh, this Dire Hit. So, let's see how it goes. Ludicolo is kind of just... Ludicolo scared the big guy out, huh? Um... Well, that's... Okay. Kinda don't, I kind of don't really care if uh, Ludicolo falls over there. I really don't. He's gonna bring Kingdra in and get the rain started. Um... I know that Rayquaza can... This ability, Airlock, nullifies... Um, weather conditions and stuff, but I think an Ice Beam here... Ice Beam didn't do anything! Why? It's four times! That does not seem right to me, but... Either way, we should get our berries here. And that should probably let us sweep through the rest of the team. We'll have rain for one more turn after Dragapult, so we should be faster than everything. Uh, I think we Hurricane here. Oh, they haven't got- oh, that was a crit and that didn't do anything. What in the world is happening? 
I feel like this I mean, they're just taking a lot more than they should. It feels like they have um, and this guy, I'm gonna go ahead and Dreadnought on the fact that it probably resists. Perfect, and now that he's not doing anything for a turn, we can Shell Smash. And this should probably ensure that we KO everything with Vicious Rend at Strong Draw. Basically, this is, uh, not Fortnite, uh, Dracovish 2.0. For some reason, I was running different names in my head. Uh, let's just see if a Cell Walk kills just for the Swag Factor. Yep, easily. A 40 base power move. Let's go. Yep, Ivy, I wouldn't say anything either. A candy jar or a road ball, dude. A uh, Dynamax fan, a Mega Bracelet, like anything. Any one of those would be much more appreciated. Alrighty, um, one floor before the big dog uh, gets his fight again. I think everybody's fine. Just gonna eat there on those and for Quick Claw. Maybe we just give it a Dreadnought. Clawitzer already has two of them. Do we have rain up? Oh, it's normally raining in the jungle. This actually helps a lot. I don't know. Slitherwing, the only grass move Slitherwing might have would probably be Trailblaze. And I'm kind of a little worried that it might actually have it. I think it's okay to play a little safer on this. Maybe even let Ludicolo fall over just to see if it has Trailblaze. It has Leech Life, which is kind of fine with me. And then we just get a Fake Out in. Uh, this is fine. Uh, I think we just bring Kinger in here now uh, with Hurricanes. Hit yourself. Okay, that's a little unfortunate. Can it change it to snow? Um, Dragon Energy does not KO there. That's um, a little unfortunate. Uh, I think we still bring in Swampert to bulk up and then hopefully sweep the rest of this. Um, we no longer have Shore up. We did eventually we did get Earthquake on it, which is kind of nice. I think just one uh, bulk up with the X attack and X speed should probably be enough for the rest of the team. And it's not. How does this not KO Kyurem? Is Kyurem just that fat? That's kind of it. I just didn't expect Kyurem to live at like pretty much a plus two earthquake, man. That's very, very fat. Surging strikes here should KO through the uh, health gates. Health gates, that's the word I need to use now. I keep forgetting the word sometimes, and I'm like, oh, no, it's just health gates. Um, same thing. Going for certain strike to get through health gates. What's it called? It probably KOs me with parental bond. Wow, it actually got the drop. Um, our berries are coming in. He's now plus three. Uh, that's very annoying. Oh, we have a revival seed. This KO here? doesn't. Oh my god. This is so cheap. Um, either way, we're gonna bring in Dreadnought for priority. I think we're faster. Yeah, and that KOs. Okay, cool. Um, the, the whole team really getting some use out of here. Oh my lord! First impression Durant will swarm is kinda a little scary. We have Cellrock. And now we see what's been in the back the whole time. Oh! The fire type. Mono water run. Very nice. Okay, that was probably a little closer than I would like to, even with X items, but thankfully, we don't have to worry about this clown anymore, and we'll have to worry about the Elite Four Gauntlet, and the Ivy Fight 195, and then Eternatus. Your calculations, your careful scheming, the world should be mine. It is not yours, buddy. You're literally in the jungle. If you were a real boss, you'd have a headquarters. Finally, 169 with B minus luck. We finally get the Mega Bracelet. Man. Okay, we have the Elite Four Gauntlet here, and it has not been smooth sailing, pun intended. But uh, we're gonna see what's going on, man. We're gonna take as many X items as we can. We have the X Special Defense and the X Defense in here. 
there is absolutely no way you're leading up with a grass type. Um, it's constant rain in the swamp. I am a big fan of that. Um, nothing deals with this thing like really, really, really well. We're gonna try shell smashing with Larry the Lobster here and see if we can get something done. Because we do, we're like, there's nothing that's going to outspeed us except for priority because we are swift swim and this is, uh, the rain is not going away anytime soon unless she has some sort of rain, but I doubt it, or some sort of weather, but I doubt it. And it looks like Shell Smash, Clawitzer, and our other Shell Smash Dreadnought are probably going to be putting in a lot of the work here. Um, they've been kind of sitting in the back waiting for the time to shine, and this is it. Even your Mascarada is not going to outspeed me that boy fast. Mascarada fast cat. Speaking of another cat, we've got cats on cats on cats. Okay, cool. Priority didn't do too much. Uh, another X item. We don't have another X item. We're going to... Rare Candy actually might not be bad. Um, on Swampert, because we do have the extra... I actually... If this thing has Water Absorb... It didn't. Okay. Whew. Close one. Thought I might have had a water absorb. Um, I don't know if any of these are necessarily really good. Do you get ice beam at all? No. Um, I might give you a better move. Because his moves are absolutely atrocious. Um, you don't even get Giga Drain? Let's just... Uh, let's just give you a knockoff instead of a stomp. Look at these moves. You know, this was just an extra on the team, but I'm still kind of glad to have them. Oh, now we have Nessa. The water. Water v. Water. Who is better? Um, we don't necessarily have anything to really hit that. Don't play up. Okay, did not play away. Uh, we're gonna knock off. Get super effective, and your berry's gone. Knock off another item. I will continually stay in a booty hole if I can just continually knock off your items. Um, I was just talking a lot of crap about Ludi Kolo, but here he is putting in a little bit of work, kind of setting the groundwork for the rest of the team, taking off any annoying items. Uh, I'm gonna throw on Swampert here, and I think I have the free turn to bulk up because there's no way she's staying with that fella over there. He lost his flying type, so Earthquake can actually hit. If not, this thing kind of walled Swampert. A Hurricane is not good, but we do eat that up. Oh, the defense going up by plus two. Oh, man. Living is so heartbreaking. Um, this shouldn't stay in here, but even if it does, um, it's not going to be able to do anything. Dragon Energy should be able to take care of that because it's a like, much, much, much stronger move and it's stab. Uh, I think we. Oh no! That's a little annoying. We can't person pressure anymore. Was gonna liquidate? I guess we just sent off hurricanes. I wish his ability was actually implemented in the game and it was in because once I knock him under half. He would have automatically swapped out, not getting him a turn. Liquidation is fine because we actually four times resist that. And this is one of the only mods on the team that does. We do have to be a lot more careful here, though. Um, we don't have that many members left, and one of our big guys, Swampert, is kind of out of the running right now. Uh, Veluza is back in here, and we can literally just keep throwing off Hurricanes because the weather's up. Because rain is up. We've actually, our ability is not coming into play here. Get a slime shot just to kind of save a little PP. And you're here. We just, I think we just snipe shot for rain, stab, all that good stuff. And he does not have Rockhead. And that's what would happen to Dreadnought if we did not have Rockhead. Uh, once again, no Mega. Once I get a Mega on Swampert, I'm just absolutely going to run through the rest of the teams. Um... We're gonna go ahead and just throw the, that on you. Dragon Energy should kill. Cool. Leading off the team is pretty good. Another quick call, dude. Give me an X item. I'll take the X attack. I'll take the X attack. Bayah, fighting type. 
man, my Hurricanes are going to be happy to see you. And it's not sturdy soft, which is pretty nice. Oh my god, you live that? And you drop our speed. We're still faster because of Swift Swim, for sure, but... Something might outspeed us now that we're minus one. Not the Halucha, though. Not the Halucha. And with Shell Bell, it's actually really nice because we get our HP back. And since Dragon Energy is an HP-based move, like Water Sprout or Eruption, uh, getting your health back so that it can make the move stronger is really only benefiting you. And our last Hurricane here. Do we have... We do have a Lepa, so we will... Yeah, use our Lepa to get Hurricanes back up. And... Probably just Snipe Shot here. Okay, that's a, the second Elite Four member that has used a recoil move to knock themselves out. Very nice. Uh, Kingdra, very proud of you. No! I just need a Mega Stone! Please! Um, we're... Gonna rare candy the right guy. This KO is cool. Can we get another X item, please? No, absolutely not, huh? I have a little money to re-roll. Let's take the X speed. First Raihan, the Dragon Man. Um I think. Okay, so let's do a little bit of math. Ice Beam is four times effective. So instead of doing 180, it'll do. 360? No, that's not how that works. Is that how it works? Or is it just 90 times 4, which is 360? I don't know. I don't know what's stronger. I'm just gonna go for Ice Beam. I tried doing math, and then my brain kaput it on me and did not work. And the XP is making sure that we should do this. This should actually be a pretty clean sweep. Uh, of course, Gujar is way fatter than everybody else. You still die. I didn't want to Dragon Energy just in case it was a little weaker. Um, we have two more. We might as well just go for a Viber Seed, huh? Gonna ice beam here and probably try to save our dragon energy for we're a little we have a little more health under our belt. Uh, the only thing kind of really good against this guy is Swampert. I'm gonna go for snipe shot. Just because it's in the rain. Damn. Now we use all of our berries, which is a little unfortunate. Um, but we should KO because we're plus one special attack and we got the crit. And Torkoal's in the back? Wow, I didn't expect that. Dragon Energy still KOs the crit, but nonetheless it does KO. And he did have Weather in the back, could have changed it. And now, actually the weather is not going to be up in Swamp the whole time. So I will have to use uh, our abilities here. And let's just make sure everybody's good. Okay, yeah, you need some. You're fine, 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 fine. Okay, um, we're gonna take the dire hit here because we love crits around here. And I actually want to lead off with Swampert, even though Swampert's kind of like our ace in the hole. Does this thing get? I think this thing gets the ground. Uh, it doesn't have its passive, though. It's not a boss, right? Okay, cool. Only the bosses normally have uh, passives on. We have an X speed here. Our X attack is going away. We have a dire hit. Um, I think I want to reroll for a different X item. The next defense is fine. The guy who ended one of my other runs. No way you're leading off with this. He doesn't have grassy terrain. Um, I'm going to sacrifice Lubicolo here because I really do not want to risk that guy. Uh, we're here for fake out. There's a little extra chip damage. And then a knockoff. So he's doing a ton of damage to himself, which is absolutely fine with me. I'm going to bring in something that I know is faster. And the rain is up for one more turn, so we get one free hurricane. Rillaboom is gone! Okay, we're playing... We need to play a lot smarter. I just... I don't want to lose to the same guy more than once ever. Um, a lot of the X items are helping here, and our team kind of needs it because we've been getting a little screwed over... Uh, on the Mega Items and Dynamax stuff. Uh, Poltergeist kind of doesn't do anything. Slime Shot should take it out because he did not King Shield. If he was in the other form, he definitely would have lived. This guy being here... 
What did he raise his defense? And he's not even like in the defense form. That's weird. Um, I'm bringing Clawitzer specifically so that wow he tanks that really well. Uh, no rain up. Water pulse is stab and ability. Probably water pulse. This KOs. Wow, that did KO. That one did. And he just could not get rid of Clawitzer. Clawitzer is tanky, man. I said that earlier. And this is really just proving it. An Aura Sphere? Dang, I thought that was going to KO, and it didn't. Either way. Uh, we do have a lot of our rain guys in the back now. Be able to set rain back up again. Uh, snipe shot can take him out here. And what does he have last? The Super Charizard. Oh, Leon! You're not beating the board more than once. You're not beating the board more than once. Okay, please, can we get a Megastone in between now and Ivy? It would just... It would make my day. We have a ton of money. We don't have any reroll capsules or anything. Reroll capsules. Uh, the Lock Machine. But, uh, the Elite Four Gauntlet is done. And now we just gotta work our way to Ivy. But please, I just need a Megastone in my life. Okay, uh, Ivy is continually yapping. So, we're gonna go ahead and try to put an end to that. Leading off with Ludicolo. Um, she always swaps out Ludicolo. And Ludicolo is going to kind of do the same thing that he did in one of the other ones. And just kind of be a lot more utility. And hopefully knock off a ton of items. Uh, I think we just keep going for the... Wow, a very accurate uh, fella there. We can't even get weather up. Because... Wait, no, it doesn't have airlock anymore, does it? The strong winds just override every other weather in the game? And you're faster. And you're faster. Huh. Bring Swampert in. We can't do anything with berries. Uh, we're just gonna try to head smash, I guess. Uh, this thing is also really annoying. Um, I think Kinger kind of has to go here. Uh, and then... You gotta bring in something that won't die. Swampert will obviously fall over. Same thing with Dreadnought. Maybe we bring in Clawitzer to Shell Smash. You're staying in. Not a bright move by me. Um, we go for the cross breath here. Super crit. Still lives, huh? I was talking a lot of shit about my game, but here it is. Just doing, putting in an absolute, just unnecessary amount of work. Speed raising is like, oh man. Uh, can't really do anything about that. And we're confused. Okay, I guess we're really banking on him missing a hurricane. I uh, didn't miss a hurricane. Is he gonna stay in here? Or is now our chance to shell smash? And try to sweep? Um, we have the X accuracy and the crits, so I think we just see what Dreadnought can do. Uh, should be faster, we should miss X accuracy and the crit. Vicious Ren should KO here with Strong Jaw and being plus two. I don't know what's stronger here between Head Smash and Vicious. Um, they're both neutral, none of them are more super effective. Uh, maybe just Head Smash. We live just barely. Oh, are we gonna fucking die to the goddamn Iron Barbs? We don't. We didn't die to Iron Barks. Head Smash KO's Rayquaza? Dreadnought? The guy Dreadnought? Dude, I was like, this is it. I'm gonna have to restart this run. Ain't no way, officer. Oh, you get a Sacred Ash here. Wow. 
came in big dreadnought. I was like, this is gonna fall over to the iron barbs, but maybe Ficious Ren doesn't do physical damage. Like maybe it doesn't touch the user. And that's why we didn't get KO that's why we didn't get KO'd. No way! No way! Oh my okay, we shot Eternatus next, man. Okay, uh Eternatus fight. Yep. Blah 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 blah. And we have I want one of these times for this thing to be shiny. Uh it won't happen right now. But Master Ball is done. And I wonder if this run is going to have some reference to, like, too much water. When it rains, it pours. There's too many good water puns, man. One day, I'll get them. Okay, uh, water is done. Ghost, Ice, Dark, Fairy, and Dragon. We only have five left. I am saving Dragon for last. I do want to do an Eternatus run and see if Eternatus can actually beat the Classic Mode himself. So we'll find out. We got Toodle, Horsey, Mudkip. Lotad, who we just picked up on like literally the first floor. Sobble came in kind of big, not really. Uh, and then Clodger, uh, big old Larry the Lobster boy. Okay, uh, that is it. Thanks for, if you made it this far, thank you very much. See you next video. It'll probably be another ride on video, but please let me know what other type you want me to do next.